Hello, my name is Keith and I represent Quality Water Products. Quality Water Products is a sister company of the EJ Prescott Corporation and we're distributors of water, drainage and sewage uh, products that we distribute throughout New England, New York and the Midwest Territory. What I would like to present today is one of our products which is a 24 inch ductile iron hinge cover. Some of the differences between ductile iron and cast iron products that are primarily used in the street are, number one, the weight factor of the product. Ductile iron is about half the weight of cast iron and the load capacity. The load capacity of ductile iron is, is approximately four times as strong as cast iron. And what I'd like to do now is just point out a couple of features and benefits of this particular product versus a cast iron product. Number one, I want to target the frame of this, of this unit. The frame of the unit has a lot of buttresses and holes around the perimeter, unlike a cast iron frame that's generally smooth and very heavy. When you place a structure on a precast or on a chimney that you've created to place it in the street, you put a bed of mortar down into the perimeter to secure that unit onto the precast structure. On a, on a cast iron structure, it's very heavy and very smooth, so when you place that on the structure, you want to get the tightest bond that you can get between the precast and the structure. When you place a pre when you place a uh, cast iron structure down, a lot of the weight forces that material out from that structure, and you have to build a large collar up around it to support that structure. With a ductile iron structure being approximately half the weight of cast iron, and because of the different configuration built into this frame, with all the holes and they actually call those installation ports, what happens when you place that frame structure on that precast is that material will actually squish up through that frame and you can simply fold that material over and encapsulate that three-dimensional structure onto that precast. What that does is it gives you a tighter and longer lasting bond, which is the point of putting this in because obviously when these things are trafficked in the street, all those traffic, and if, especially if it's on the wheel line of traffic, create a hammering effect on these units, obviously breaking down that material over time and if you can get a tighter bond on that, it's going to last longer. On the cover of this unit, you're going to see a couple of different designs on this. Number one, it incorporates a hinge on the cover. Ductile iron being a little bit different than, than cast iron, they can, they can cast these in a thinner profile and get a little more creative with the design. So what they've done is incorporated a hinge. And what that does for the end user is it puts the end user in an ergonomically correct position to access and replace this cover. When you're, when you're out in the street and you're working with cast iron products, number one, they're heavy and you have to get down, bend over, hyperextend your spine and add weight to that, which always creates a little bit of damage in your spine. And of course, municipalities are always dealing with liability issues with, with personnel getting hurt. And if you can eliminate that factor, this ductile iron will help the municipalities do that. By incorporating a hinge for the accessibility of this unit, it, it eliminates approximately 50% of the stress involved on your body for accessing and replacing this cover. The hinge is on the back side of the cover. You have multiple access points on this cover for, uh, for accessibility. You have three access points on, on the top of this cover. One is for a one inch pry bar. The center unit is for a uh, J hook or a lifting hook. And the third is, is a little slot that I like to use a pickaxe for, the, uh, for the, just the accessibility. And the pickaxe is a very small tool you can just throw in the back of any pickup truck and have that available to open these covers. So I want to show you how you access this particular cover. I simply drop the pickaxe into this cover and I can simply in an upright position without using my spine walk past this cover very gently and raise it up. At 90 degrees this cover locks, automatically blocks into place. You physically cannot drop this cover onto somebody's head that is coming out of the chamber or wants to access this chamber. To close this cover, I am behind the unit in a safe position. I have no fear of catching my fingers and toes. I'm not using my spine to lift this. I stand directly behind the unit and I physically have to lift it up very gently and drop it back into position. Again, I'm using my shoulders and my legs to access this lift. I simply drop the cover into position. It's self-centering, always drops where it should. A couple other points of this cover is this cover is designed to burp. If they have any surges in the system from water or gases that build up in the, in the source system, this cover is designed never to blow off. And it's because of this hinge they've incorporated in the design. This cover has the availability 
to burp and release any early pressure that's present in that system. It'll continue to do this and relieve any pressure so this cover will never blow off and create some kind of catastrophic accident. Because if you have enough water flow or gases present in the system, it can actually blow those covers right off and then you have an opening in the street that pedestrians can get hurt in or you can create a catastrophic accident by having a car or vehicle drive their tire right into that and obviously that's going to be a tragic accident. So if we can prevent that in any way, that's what this hinge product will, will help you do. Also, this hinge product incorporates a, a locking system on it. It's got a small dimple on the cover with a thin skin of ductile iron. And it's a very simple process to add a lock into this at any time. This is good for, uh, to prevent theft as well as to secure the cover into place. A very simple, uh, very simple pent, stainless steel pent lock and a stainless steel paddle goes underneath. It's about a five minute installation. You simply drill through a very thin skin of ductile iron that's on the cover, place the lock in, and you can put that in at any time. We can install that lock at the factory before these units go out, or you can place this lock in this unit at any time in the future if that's necessary. Also, we can badge these covers and put any additional identification on them. We have all of the normal listings, sewer, water, electrical, etc. But we can incorporate a badge onto this system if you'd like to put a city logo, date of installation, or a GPS location as well. Some of the uh, features on the inside of this cover I'd like to show you as well. I'm going to access this cover. This cover will drop down to 130 degrees as well for access into the chamber. Blocks at 90. The interior of this frame has a 360 degree rubber gasket around the perimeter. This gasket is multifunctional. Number one, it'll keep this cover quiet so you won't have any more rattling covers in town. Two, it keeps a high level of water out of the system, which is what we want to do in the sanitary source system. Three, it acts as a shock absorber, so it will actually absorb over 64% of the initial traffic impact that will help prevent the picture frame cracking that goes around the asphalt and the breakdown of the mortar mix that you place this system in. Also, what that, what that gasket will do is it eliminates the corrosion factor between the cover and frame as well. So for accessibility, you don't have to get out and uh, wail on this for about five minutes with a sledgehammer to release that, uh, that corrosion between the cover and frame. It just will not happen because of the gasketing material around the perimeter of this cover. This cover is available from 24 inch up to 36 inch profiles, nominal, uh, nominal height of 4 inch on the 24 through 32 on the 36 inch structure, it's approximately 6 inches tall. We carry these products in stock at Quality Water, we're located in Southbury, Massachusetts, and uh, a great number of the EJP locations also stock this product. So we carry a full variety of this as well as the catch basins. We have 24 by 24 inch catch basins, both four flange and three flange, as well as the full variety of these covers and the sizes I just mentioned, so we can get them to you without any extensive time frame. I want to thank you for your time, and we look forward to hearing from you in the future. Thank you.